Hello YouTube Retro Chef here, back with a car boot, uh, some eBay buys and a trade with a fellow tuber. So, first things first, there it is, here's to you Carl, Wooden 37. Don't know about where really you are, but today, Sunday, weather was terrible. So going car booting wasn't as good as it should have been. <clears throat> Saturday, round here in Essex was really, really hot. But today, I had rain this morning. It was just, yeah, so basically the car boot wasn't as good as it should have been. So I haven't picked up as much as I normally do. It's one or two. All right, little bits. Um, nothing, nothing major this weekend or in June week. I want to show the um, my trade first. It's with a fellow tuber, Woolly Weevil Duncan. So, hello, Duncan. Finally got our deal done. Um, for a couple of days, we were messaging each other. He was after. Well, it started off from rival schools. If you remember, I picked up the first disc for rival schools. And he messaged me and said, oh, I've got Rival Schools Disc 2. I'm missing Disc 1. So, we're trying to sort of deal out. Then I did my trades video. And it was after a few few of the bits I've, I sent him. I'm not going to say because I don't know if he's going to do a video, but I'm, I'm sure he will. Um, so, the, your passport came yesterday on Saturday. <clears throat> um, I only opened the top to see exactly if it was games and you know I got a quick little gist I didn't really look through it properly so I saw there's a note on top I actually forgot to put a note in yours so I had such a mad week at work um, yeah mad week at work so I didn't really get a chance to do things properly on my um, my trades so my apologies to you Duncan um, I will make it up next time but I'll, I'll do you a nice letter because uh, everyone keeps talking about my letters now talking about that uh, Two things I want to say. I've had a couple of messages about my TV. Someone asked me, I can't remember who it was now, because someone messaged me, PM'd me, and said, Oh, um, what TV is that? But for some reason I deleted the message. But basically, it's a 50 inch LG plasma um, that I'm, that's in the conservatory. I'm using that for the, for the gaming, for the older stuff at the minute. Uh, I've got a, I've got two, I've got Bang Olsen. Uh, CRT, the old um, Avant, the tall one, just like um, two UK had in the sh in the shed, ready for my retro games. And I've got a, an old Toshiba as well because obviously there's so many scars. So I don't know if I have two or one when I get set. But yeah, that's an LG 50-inch plasma TV. And then the other thing I want to say is this game. I bought this um, last weekend in a bundle of Wii games. Really good game. Um, it's different, you know. Um, it's quite it's quite funny because I watched I watched um, Metal Jesus. I don't know if anyone watched Metal Jesus rocks one of the other tubers on him, and he recommended it as a hidden gem. And it is it's a good game. Uh, and I've seen it. I saw it yesterday in CEX. I think for two fifty or three pounds. So definitely worth getting. But that's enough waffle. Let's go on with a um, the trade. So yeah, it started off say so through rival schools. We're PMing each other. Um, and then we finally got a deal together. He sent the stuff out. So he got to me yesterday. And I sent mine out Saturday. So he should get his Tuesday. Like I said, apologies. You'll, you'll get it. Um, so it's going to be a live opening on on the old uh, YouTube. We was laughing about the boxes about um, postage. Because postage is crazy at a minute. And he was messaging me saying, oh, it's cost this and that. And it's this way, that way. So it's mad. But yeah. So there's a note in the top. I'm gonna I'm gonna try and read this now. Lee enclosed off the cube and the GameCube. Uh, sorry, Dreamcast games as agreed. Uh, also, rival schools which start a trade going. Have chucked in a WrestleMania GBA as a Brucey box, but not complete. Good job, you only played the cartridge. You're exactly right. That should be my um my slogan. You only played the cartridge. Got uh got there in the end. We did. Um, till the next time, Duncan Willie Weeble, and he's put a bomb, also a badge. So yeah, I don't know, little note, so I'm going to frame these, I'm going to frame all these. 
So I sent him a load of stuff. I sent him some good bits. He sent me some good bits back. Um, I was quite surprised. I wouldn't have any, much more interested in the stuff I sent him because. I've seen them go for quite a lot on eBay, but you know, whatever, eBay or whatever, I've seen them go for quite a few quid, so but no interest from no one else, so well done to you. Right, so it's packed it really well. So this the this is the I'll do the one on top because it's a Brucey. So what he's done is which he's done is Road to WrestleMania, he's flattened it for me, which is good. And there's the cart. So I haven't played that yet. I'm well, quite interested. Yep. Now these are some of the trades. I can see a badge there. I'm not going to look at it yet as a badge here. Um, these are some of the trades that we've done. Uh, I've now noticed. I'm looking at one of them and I've actually got this one. I must have. I'm stupid when it comes to trades. But anyway, it doesn't matter. So. First trade. Which I've got. But this is in better condition than mine. So. Um, Road Leader. Rogue Leader or Rogue Squadrons 2. Very well packaged, just like how I like to be pack packaged my stuff. It's all in there. Very nice, thank you. I can see there's a badge in here. I'm not going to open it, okay, yeah. It's a badge, I'm scared. Resident Evil. I've got this, but my brother's get getting back into gaming, or back into retro gaming. So, and when I told him you can play the old games on the old Wii, Sorry, when you can play the old games and games on the way, he was up for it. So, Paul, my big brother, love you. That's for you. This game I wanted. Uh, I don't I don't normally see it out of that. So, um, I quite like Odd World. So, I thought I'd give it a go. It's on the next box. Odd World, Stranger's Wrath. I remember someone telling me, you shoot. There we go. Live ammo, choose how to shoot. Uh, live ammo, choose how to use. Yeah, someone told me you shoot animals or something. So, that's all complete. Very well packaged. Really nice condition. I'll have a go at that later. More combat deadly alliance on the GameCube. I haven't actually got I haven't got this. So again. Very nice. Now I've still I can see a badge there. I can see the badge there, but I'm not gonna I'm gonna leave it to the end because I'm I'm interested in what it is. Now this is the game I wanted, Rival Schools. This is um it's it's a it's a rare game I've seen in England. Or maybe I'm going to get cut down there, but I don't really see it much out in the back. So I know in NTSC format and that it's all you can get. It. I've seen it on eBay. Really nice condition. So look, the blue disc and the manual. So let's let's reunite the game. So we need a drum roll or some like kind of music. So we're going to reunite. Disc one. Ah, oh, it's in there. <laughs> so we now have a fully complete rival schools. United by fate. I'm looking forward to playing that dunks on top man. Now this one um it's for a dreamcast. I've been looking for this for a while and I got confused a little bit if I had it or not, but I haven't it's Shadow Man. And for once Let's see if let's see if the box breaks. They always break when you open them. Oh, it didn't break. It's all in there. It's all complete. I'd like to check it. Oh, Duncan, Duncan, you sent me another game. I, I didn't pay for this one. I didn't pay for this one, mate. Virtual Fire Free T uh, Free TB. Did you know it's in there, fella? Message me. When you're making out, I'll try to steal it. But yeah, so. Fantastic. The last game, which again, I have actually got it, but um, I f I, by the time he sent it, I totally forgot, so I think mine will be up for trade because this is better condition than mine. Great game. Power Stone. Another game, uh, Dreamcast box doesn't break. All the bits in there. Fantastic. I haven't got a free game in this one, Duncan, so maybe. Palestine. Now, there's a badge in here. What is this, Duncan? <laughs> I don't know if you've made this, mate, or if you've bought it, or if you've seen it, but that is absolutely fantastic. The Retro Chef. See what? 
You'll wear it now. See that? The retro chef. So Duncan, absolute legend mate. I hope you make the video or whatever I, what I sent you. Um, yeah, so yeah, fantastic. <laughs> the retro chef badge. That's great. Now, I'm going to do my eBay pickups first, or eBay purchases. Uh, all different sellers. There's a bit of a um, two, uh, three of the games I've got. People write in the descriptions, uh, shocking. Oh, wait, some of the these two games here I'm going to show you now. Two Game Boy games. One's a no, they're both Game Boy games here. Yeah. One is Tetris DX. Same seller. And Batman Return of Joker, which is quite a good game. Now, in the eBay listing, all you saw was this. Saw it like that. Description said nothing. Um, blank. Didn't even click on it. So I messaged him. I said, "Look, um, you know, is this for both games? Is this South by Fence? Nothing back. Got down to the last couple of minutes. I bid. I'm not on P. I've got and then I kind of thought, what am I going to get sent? Because he's never got back to me still. So yeah, basically I got both of these for 99p. Plus £1.20 to send it. And he sent it quite well, so whoever you are, thank you. I've been playing Batman, that's a good game. It's quite tough though. Tetris DX, I haven't got... It's just Tetris in colour, basically. I thought it was a Game Boy Colour game. I think it is. Yeah. Them two are good. The next one was pretty much the same. Um, it was on eBay. Different seller altogether. Just a picture of the game. No description. Again, I messaged them because he just said NES game. What was it? Yeah, NES game. Capital NES. NES game. Messaged them. Again, is this for the one the game for sale? This was this was up for two quid the starting price. So again, I waited. I bid two pound. Still no message back. Last minute I bid. Like I said, I got it. And that was uh, Little Nemo Dream Master. Uh, it's, it's, it's got the sleeve. Got the sleeve in the game. So no manual. But for two pound. So yeah. I remember on Game Chasers. So if anyone, I'm sure if some of you watch Game Chasers, they were saying this is a, a rare game. But I've seen it quite a lot around actually. And I've only, I've never bought it because I want to try and get it in the box. But the box is alright. I mean, it's got a little bit of wear. I mean. How old is this? This is 1999. It's got three years on it. 91, 1989. So it's, it's over 20 years old. Bit of wear. For £2. Can't complain. The next one I bought, uh, I was watching Metal Jesus again. Some of these hidden gems, wee hidden gems. Again, this was just a picture of the game. No description. Uh, again, I waited to the last minute and bid. I got this for a pound. Overlord, Dark Legend. Now I couldn't, I couldn't sleep last night. So when I woke up this morning about six o'clock in the morning, so my body wakes up then because obviously for work, I um, come downstairs in the conservatory and I, I put this on. This game is w wicked. It's really good. Worth getting. It's all complete. Really good game. You have to control your these little monsters, little minions, and that, and you have to fight. And it's really good. Definitely worth getting. And I'll see it in CEX on Saturday. Um, because well, I knew I bought it. And I think it was three pound or three fifty something like that. Definitely get this, boys and girls. Overlord Dark Legend, hidden gem. So that's that's all my eBay and uh, my trade so far. The last little bit is all. Um, Car boot today. Now, like I said, I mean, let me just—I can see that's not moving in the background. Let's. Uh, I can't even do anything. I thought I was going to show you some gameplay, but it hasn't. I should have checked really. 
Kabu, sorry. To Kabu. Oh. <laughs> so Kabu, yeah, weather was rubbish. My eldest daughter wanted to come. And then my little daughter knew who was leaving. So I ended up taking both my girls, my two and a half old and my nine year old. I carried my two and a half old, so, you know, three years old, she's nearly three, she's three in September anyway. So I just call her three. So I was carrying her around, I was at my arms were killing me. For so long, I was carrying her for about an hour. Because when she was walking, she was walking like this, little. She was grabbing everyone's stuff off the tables, it was mad. But it was good fun. So, I didn't pick up a lot. Um, but what I did pick up, it's a couple of the ones. Got one lonely GameCube game, uh, Game Boy game on a table. Um, loads of PC games. And he said to me, I said, "Oh, is that all the games you got?" And he goes, "Oh, I sold a bun I sold a Game Boy with a load of games." And I was like, "Oh, I don't know what he had." I do want to ask. I hate if someone says to me, "Oh, I sold a load," I don't want to ask what they had because I get, I think, oh, I should have been here earlier, or whatever. But anyway, 50p, Aliens 3. And I've seen you, Ninja Bear Hugs, Stu. I've been seeing you've been playing it. I haven't actually played it yet, so but for 50p, I have that. And then I went to a, I went to a another another stall. Walked around a little bit. Didn't find much, but little for about 10, 15 minutes. Loads of clothes and rubbish, basically. Seems to be what it is now. So, so one stall. Loads of PS1 games, loads and loads and loads. Um, quite a few rubbish ones, if I'm honest. I'm, I'll say I picked the best ones out of the bunch, which is not saying a lot because they're not the best ones, but they're, you know, alright. Some are just filler, really, like this one. FIFA 99, with the legend Dennis Burkep on the front. Look at that. Really nice, really nice condition. All in there, it's all nice. 50p. Now this I thought I had, and I'm hoping my brother Paul hasn't got this at home. But I swear we had this, Paul. So maybe you can, or well, maybe we sold it. I don't know. It's Grand Theft Auto London. It's in nice condition. Saw in there all the book and everything. That was 50p. Next one, my daughter saw. She grabbed it. Didn't even though. This kind of game was out with these with Simpsons. Simpsons Wrestling. Lovely condition. Box and manual. Oh god, it's later. This looks quite fun actually. That was 50p. This one I picked up. Um, and I didn't really check it properly. So I'm a bit annoyed at myself now. Holding the kids and that. Ready to Rumble 2. Oh, it hasn't got the uh, sleeve in it. And the case is broken as well. <laughs> So, broken case, manual in the game, so, manual in the game, but no front sleeve, but that was 50p as well. This one I saw, say, I've never seen this before, then today I saw three of them, like a bus, Pitfall 3D, Beyond the Jungle, I don't know if it's going to be good or what, but yeah, really nice condition. Some codes in there or something. Book and menu. It's all in there. 50p. The last one I picked up. Because um, so I've got this one. My badge. <laughs> I picked this one up. A uh, bit of a trade fodder. As you say, Stu. Really good game. Don't see it much out, so I grabbed it. Platinum edition, but Spider Man. I've already got this, so this is up for trade. So, Retro Game 100, Mostin. Retro, Retro Game Hunter, Front 100, sorry, Mostin. If you're after that, bruv. Just all saying out. But yeah, so that was 50p, so all those 50p each. Um, the next few was a lady. Um, so loads of clothes and stuff, rubbish, and she had a few games in the end. Um, she had some Xbox games, some PS2 games, and some 
PS1, but nothing, again, nothing, I picked the best three really, I'll say. One of them, I'm not really too sure on my back, I've never seen it before. So maybe, uh, Rob, Tino777, maybe you can help me out this one. I've never seen it before. The first one is Warriors. That's complete. I've got it on the Xbox, but for the GameCube, for the um, PS2, I thought I'd grab it. This game, Rob, so maybe you know better than me. Never seen it before. Checked it on CEX, it's going for a pan, which makes no sense, but there's none of them in stock that are selling for a pan, so it must be quite hard to get hold of. But anyway, Seven Blades. Now, I haven't played it yet, I'm going to play it this afternoon, because it's now 10 to 6, or evening I'll play it. Uh, it's all in this, all complete. Really nice condition, that was the pans. I've never seen that, so that might be a good one. The last one, I swapped this game on the GameCube, but I had two of them. Uh, I think it's yeah, yeah, well, sorry, with uh, Daz, hello mate, Cojones de Loro. Um, but this is on the Xbox, so maybe he needs to get that one as well, but I haven't got it on here. That is Bloody Raw Extreme. Really, really, really nice on the Xbox. I had a little go of it earlier on. It's really nice on the Xbox. Nice condition. That was a pan. All those three were for, for a pan each, so that's three quid. The last few bits I've got were just. Um, One's a game, but the rest are just um, peripherals, some nice bits. I thought I saw this. We had one before, we couldn't get on, we couldn't, we couldn't get it to work probably, but she saw this and she wanted it. This the eye toy Astro Zoo. Saw in there. That was a pan. She saw that. It's a big box, got the camera in there, the game, and that's really nice condition. Which we'll explain later, but we had it. Well, I got the PS3 item and I sold it. <coughs> couldn't, just couldn't get used to it, so but we'll try this one out. So, yeah, that was a pan, so she's happy now. We'll play it later. There was, say, there was a, someone said a load of games and that, and say a lot of them I had. None of them were worth getting. He had a PS1, uh, the actual PS1, the small one. I've already got one. And he had um, a few other old games and that. And he had controllers and that and some other, something else bagged up. So I said, how much is the controller? He said, oh, a pan. And he goes, I said, how much is this? It's a four-way adapter. It's like in a, it's not in grey, it's like a whitish colour. It's really nice. So he, he wanted a pan for that. He wanted a pan for that. For the white controller. Because um, my PS1's this colour as well. And I think, my, I don't think I've got a, I think mine's a grubby, grubby colour of this. So both of them, I've gone together for a pan, so you're not 50p off each, so pan deep, at 50p each, was well worth it. The next thing I got, or the last thing I got, is something for my wife, She, when I come over it she laughed and she got embarrassed about it, but last week I, I got a Turkish party sing star, because she's Cypriot, Turkish Cypriot, she speaks Turkish, and obviously I had no microphones. I got two microphones all in there. It's got the adapter and everything. You see the adapter there, two microphones. And that was on the same stool. Uh, I think that was two pound or three pound. They're really heavy. They're like so. Yeah. So I'll, I'll be getting her to sing later. And that's it. I'm saying not a lot this week. Got a few more bits coming in the post. Um. I plugged the chair in, my leather chair, yesterday with my daughter and I put the music and everything. It's really good. So I'm well chuffed for that. £10 buy, can't complain. Um, what have I been doing? Yeah, that's it really. I've saved this week. I've been busy at work, but when I've been getting home, I've been playing uh, Resident Evil Deadly Silence quite a lot. Really good game, so you can get hold of that. I know it's Resident Evil 1, and but the. Uh, Rebirth Edition, which is the, um, for the DS, it's like a bit more uh, puzzle with a stylus and that. That's a really good game. I've been playing that to death, really. Last week I got Turtles as well, as I showed you that one. That's really good. It's a really good fighting game, really impressed with that. And I was playing Grand Theft Auto uh, Chinatown Wars, that's really good. Um, I've managed to I've managed to get in in there. I'll just turn the camera. Got my PS2 in in there. My Xbox, my Wii. 
on a, some other computers really as well. So slowly, slowly, don't tell my wife, this room is turning into the game room. I've got a unit in there, all my stuff. Um, she hasn't said nothing to me yet, but I've got loads of stuff in here. I've been, so I've, I've, you know, eventually I'm going to move all my stuff around anyway. But I've got so much stuff in there, she hasn't said nothing to me yet, so, which is good. So shush, don't, don't tell her, she'll go mad. Um, yeah, thanks to my new subs. I, I hit 104 subs, so that's great. Um, I think I'll do, if I get 200, I'll do a, a giveaway. Um, I'll do a giveaway for the, whoever wins. I'll, you know, draw a load of names out of the hat. Uh, something like that, anyway. But yeah, thank you so much for that. Uh, everyone's been really supporting. Ever since I made the um, video with Kahuna Zalora Daz, the Meet the Tuba, uh, I've had a, a lot more interest in my channel, which I really appreciate that, Daz. Thank you so much. Um, you know, I'm mad. I'm a, I'm a good laugh, so it's it's good when you you know Daz is great as well. I'm a really nice geezer, so I've been messaging him a lot. Always you know messaging. We don't, we don't really talk as much on the phone, but when we do talk, we always have a laugh. Woodland thirty seven Carl. I'll try and speak to you later. Mostin as well. Retro uh, Game Hunter one hundred. Uh, uh, Rob Tino seven 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 triple seven. So I've been talking to a lot of people now off YouTube. So it's, it's really good. Um, Hopefully get some more trades going. I've got one going with uh, Rob, Tino777. Uh, um, I've got a few other ones going as well. I can't remember who we've known. Um, I've got another busy week this week at work. <clears throat> Before the summer holiday, so I'm always busy. So, I'll try and go car boot next weekend if I can. Um, try and do some pickups in the week. Um... I might do another trades video because I've got quite a few doubles and things else. I, every time I go and sort, sort out my games, I always find more doubles. And I think I swear I went through all this box. But obviously, I'm I'm not doing it properly. I still need to do my Super NES, Super NES box, my Mega Drive box. Let's go through that again. My Saturn, but there's quite a few stuff I need to go through to see. That's what. Um, but I've had no interest in any, any other stuff, which I'm a bit surprised about because I thought we would have gone. Um, so yeah, that's it really. So. Thank you for everyone for all the new subs. Thank you for, you know, adding me and subscribing to me. So now I've got 104. Hopefully a few more soon. Uh, I will do a giveaway for the, for 200 subs, um, which will be good. So I'll do. I'll get something good for whoever wins. Um, yeah, that's it really. So thanks for watching, guys. I'm gonna finish my beer. And I'm gonna play. I don't know yet. Well, I want to play Seven Blades. So, so Rob, let me know about that if it's, if it's any good or not. But yeah, I'm just going to play some games now. Chill out. I'll say to you later and go to work tomorrow. Thanks, guys. See you again soon. <laughs>